And the final card is going to be a... What's up everyone? Welcome back to DC Unleashed. Today we're going to be opening up none other than another mystery power box. Guys, these are the $35 ones and so far I really love them. Hopefully we can get some more cool pulls out of it. We will find out. I was going to shoot it in my backyard. Unfortunately, it is so bright out everything would be blown out so i'm just gonna go ahead and shoot it inside and hopefully we still get some cool poles we'll have our charizard pin there hopefully the charizard pin can actually bring us some luck today and uh yeah let's go ahead jump on into this and see if we can get something really cool here we go what's up guys here we are with this mystery power box i really like these ones they are like to me the best value out of the mystery power packs i know there's a 25 dollars one and a 50 dollars one the 50 dollars ones i've opened up haven't got me anything too crazy this last one i've only opened up one of these before this is my second one go ahead and check out that other video guys it was pretty sweet the link is down in the description let's go ahead and see what this has this has four booster packs one mystery pack one figure and one deck box plus a few more things Let's see, it comes with 10 assorted cards, one code card, one coin, and one randomly inserted bonus. We are going after that because that would be pretty sick, and it'd be pretty cool to get like an older booster pack, which is pretty cool if we pulled something. Before we get on into this, guys, in my last one, I pulled this Primal Groudon out of it, which is pretty sweet looking, and this Charizard pin is just here to bring us some more good luck in my pack battle I did. It did not come through for me. Charizard, you failed me on my last pack battle I did. Be sure to check that one out down below as well and let's go ahead and get on into this and hopefully we get something pretty amazing eventually all right here we go we got into it i think what i'm gonna do is pull like one pack out at a time and you know go from there so here let's see we got a sampling pack we have a generations booster pack i don't know if that one would be considered like the vintage pack or not and oh check that out guys that is so sick looking same one as the pin awesome 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 i think it was meant to be charizard is coming through for us again let's go ahead lay that one down so you guys can kind of see it as well i'll set that one. let's go ahead and set it out here all right let's continue guys we have a coin in here we have the Ooh, uh, who is that, guys? Let me know down in the comments. What? Who's on this coin? I'm not 100% sure. Let me know down in the comments. We'll set that one right up there. And let's continue. And we have this box right here, the uh, card box, which is pretty cool. And it has uh, the last one I opened had some the assorted cards and some like dividers in it. Let's go ahead and see what other packs we can get. We have a. Roaring Skies, which is always fun to open, an Ancient Origin, a Phantom Forces, and another pr a Primal Clash. So I believe the uh, Vintage Mystery Pack would be this Generations, I think. Those are the packs we got. Let's go ahead and save the Generations one for last. Roaring Skies, Ancient Origins, and the Phantom Forces. And then this Sampling Pack as well. We will save those for a little bit. Let's go ahead and open up this box and see what assorted cards we got and what else. So there is just like a little card divider. And here are the cards. A Poliwag. A Kakuna, a Ponita, a Magnemite, a Machop, a Weedle, a Super Potion. There is the Code card, and we have an Energy card, and a Soul Rock, Ace Trainer, and a Backwards card. Oh, an Absol EX. Check that out. Oh, because these packs are guaranteed one EX or GX, I'm pretty sure. So there is that card. That is awesome. We're going to keep this one right up top right there. And uh, let's go ahead and get these other ones out of the way. Let's go ahead and start out with the sampling pack. These aren't anything special, but uh, let's go ahead and see what we can get out of it. They, are, they should be just like common cards, I believe. There's nothing crazy out of these ones. And it comes with a list, as always, like a checklist of the black and white. So that's pretty cool. We'll set that off to the side. And here are the cards we got, guys. Nothing special out of these, but still pretty cool from the black and white. Let's go ahead and jump on into this Primal Clash. Can we get an Ultra Rare better? Let's see. We will find out really quick. Here. Oh, it is a green and white. I don't know if they did that, but I'm going to set this one off to the side. And we're going to do the card trick. One, two, three to the front. And start. We are starting out with a bit off. Bit off. A Nido Queen, which is an uncommon, a Mash Marsh Tomp, Marsh Tomp, a Freebus, an Illumis, a Hippopotas, 
a Slugma, a Nidoran, a Reverse Ninetales. Check out that artwork, guys. That is actually really cool artwork. I really like that. It is a reverse rare in the final card. It's going to be a Mega Gardevoir EX. That is awesome, guys. That's why I love these packs. They are so sweet. I believe I got like three or four Ultras in my last pull. Mega Gardevoir EX. We're going to set this one right up top as well. That is pretty cool pulls to start out with. Plus, we got this reverse rare. All the reverse rares will go right up at the top right here. And that is the first pack, guys. That is awesome. All right, let's go ahead and jump on to this next pack, Ancient Origins. The first pack turned out to be awesome. Let's see if the second pack will do just as well. Hopefully, we can get another ultra rare because that Mega Gardevoir, guys, is amazing. We know we got a Magic Carp. That's what we're starting out with. And, ooh, it is another green and white code. That is awesome. Let's go ahead, do the card trick. One, two, three to the front and start. This could be another ultra rare. Paint Roller of Vaporeon with awesome evolution. I love evolutions. A Gloom, a Magic Carp, an Unknown, a Ball Toy, Bell Toy, a Malamar, a Cumbi, a Reverse Larvesta. Larvesta with Combustion in the final card is a. Regular rare Gyarados, guys. That's still an awesome looking card. Gyarados is just an always cool card, even though it's regular rare. Nothing special, but that is okay. We're gonna move on to the next pack. We are here with a Phantom Force. XY Phantom Forces. Hopefully, we can get something. We are one for two right now. And let me. Wow, I am destroying this pack. Let's see. It is a green and white code awesome you know what here you go guys i will give you this one i've been keeping some because i want to build up my like online deck collection and stuff but um i just recently started doing that i used to give them all away but i want to keep a couple for now and uh maybe in the future i'll go back to giving you guys all of them but i still give out some of them so here we go a boldor a kingler an energy a dino a diano a bronzer a krabby a Gumi, chancy a reverse Litleo, and the final card is a regular rare Livini. Livini, I believe. That is okay, so nothing special out of that pack either. On to this Roaring Skies, which I love Roaring Skies. Roaring Skies is probably like in my top five sets to open. Um, just because they got some really cool Pokemon and everything. There's the code card. Let me know what you guys get down in the comments. And we're going to do one, two, three to the front and start. Here we go. We got a Tranquil, a Gliscor, a Glade Spirit Link, a Fletchling, a Bagon, an Electric, Electric, I believe, a Tallow, an Execute, as I'm sliding, an Unpheasant Reverse. Uh, it's just uncommon, though. Unpheasant reverse uncommon in the final card of this Roaring Skies pack. Can you come through for us? It's going to be a Shaman EX. Check out that card. That is awesome. That's why I love these packs, guys. I know I said this last time we just pulled that card of war, but there, so far, I've been guaranteed at least two Ultras plus the one that comes in it. A Shaman EX. Check out that card. That is so beautiful looking. Let's go ahead and set that one right there. And we are on to our final pack of the Generations which I believe is the mystery pack. Let's go ahead, see what we can get out of this, and continue. Hopefully we can get something really cool. I haven't opened up a ton of these. The only generation packs I have opened were from the uh, mystical collection boxes from Target. I've opened up a few of those, and we got some pretty cool stuff out of them. So let's go ahead and continue. We are starting with a Swablu, a Clefable, a Machoke, a Zubat, a Magmar doing a crazy looking punch right there. A energy card, a Dud Duo, a reverse rare Machamp. Check that card out. We got a reverse rare. And what else do we got? We got a Welly. And the final card is going to be a Hollow Machamp, guys. Check that out. That is awesome. We got this reverse rare. Plus this Hollow Machamp, so cool. We got some really cool pulls. Let's go ahead and redo a quick recap. So we got some pretty cool cards out of this. I hope you guys are enjoying these. If you are new here, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Hit that subscribe button. And also, let me know what your favorite booster pack we opened up in the, this Mystery Power Box and what your thoughts on the new Mystery Power Boxes. And as always, we will see you next time on BC Unleashed. Bye!